a future train station in Jerusalem near the sacred Western Wall will bear the name of President Donald Trump, Israel's Minister of Transportation said Wednesday, calling it an honor bestowed in response to Trump's decision to recognize Jerusalem as the Israeli capital. The Western Wall is the holiest place for the Jewish people, and I decided to name the train station that leads to it after President Trump following his historic and brave decision to recognize Jerusalem as the capital of the State of Israel, Transportation Minister Yisrael Katz said in a statement, according to the Jerusalem Post. The station would be an extension of a high-speed, underground rail line connecting Tel Aviv to Jerusalem. The project which is in its initial stages and will require further government approval, will include excavation of more than two miles of tunnel beneath Jerusalem's contested Old City and near, but not directly beneath, the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, according to the Associated Press. Trump's decision earlier this month to recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel and begin the process of moving the U.S. Embassy there has met with widespread criticism, aside from the Israeli government. The status of Jerusalem, the eastern portion of which was annexed by Israel in 1967 has long been a contested issue between Israelis and Palestinians. Israel has declared Jerusalem its capital, while Palestinians would be sure to seek East Jerusalem as their capital in any two-state peace solution. Past U.S. administrations had kept the American embassy in Israel in Tel Aviv, the city that hosts other international embassies in an effort to remain neutral in peace negotiations between Israelis and Palestinians. Trump promised during his campaign to recognize Jerusalem as Israel's capital, a pledge presidents from both parties had made in the past but ultimately did not keep. By signing up you agree to receive email newsletters or alerts from Politico. You can unsubscribe at any time. The announcement from Trump was condemned especially loudly by Palestinian leaders, who swore off any involvement in future U.S. sponsored peace talks. The U.S. president's announcement sparked protests and violence in the Middle East, as well as a U.N. General Assembly resolution criticizing Trump's decision. The planned train station bearing Trump's name also drew criticism from Palestinian leaders. The Israeli extremist government is trying to race against time to impose facts on the ground in the city of Jerusalem. Palestine Liberation Organization Executive Committee member Wazel Abu Yusuf told Reuters.